Hey, I wanted to show you guys this really cool record store. It's like an old school record store called Mill Valley Music in Mill Valley. It's on Miller Avenue here. The owner's name is Gary, he's super friendly and has an amazing record collection. So let's go in and check it out. So up front, he always has these deals on vinyl and CDs and lemons. You need some lemons for 25 cents. And he's got these uh, t-shirts here. Mill Valley Music t-shirts. Various things like that. And the logo. So he's got some awards here, best music. Those awards are cool. Almost every year. <laughs> From Pacific, huh? Yeah. Yeah, they do a best of Marin issue. So this is it. He's got everything from posters to vinyl to CDs to cassettes, right? You have cassettes? Yep. DVDs. DVDs. Lots of DVDs. I usually come over here and check out the DVD section all here. And these awesome posters. A lot of these remind me of the Fillmore. Is that kind of what... Are these light posters that would have been in the Fillmore and stuff? Yeah. 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 Fillmore, Avalon, Winterland. So for those of you that have never been or seen this store before, I'm going to leave the contact information in the comments and uh, give Gary a call anytime you need something. He'll get it for you for sure. But he's got so much inventory, as you can see, it's stacked up. So if you do come by, uh, set some time aside to look at everything, because it's overwhelming. <laughs> right? CDs, posters. Who collects? Do you collect all the Godzilla oh, yeah. stuff? I'm a, I'm a collector. The Godzilla. Go, go, Godzilla. Blue Oyster Cult. Yeah, like that stuff too. Got a couple big ones up there. Oh, I'm filming back there. These are awesome. This collection. What's your favorite one to collect? I really I'm into the Godzillas and stuff. I think there's big ones there. You know. I just watched Son of Godzilla yesterday. You know, oh, they're I, was, always I, was, fun. I was laughing and stuff. Yeah, those are always fun. The baby is so funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, Blondie. Blondie in a box. <laughs> this is cool. Pink Floyd. Yeah, Pink Floyd. Wish you were here. Huh. So how long have you had this store? 13 years. Impressive. <laughs> 13 years going on 20. Yeah, really? <laughs> right? There's another corner here. Jimi Hendrix up there. Yeah, those are awesome. Days. Hendrick, Shredden, Jethro Tull, Ian Anderson, The Stones, and a lot of new vinyl, as you know. Vi vinyl's outselling everything now, right? Over uh, of, of the stuff that's actual physical, it's the biggest seller right now, yeah. So vinyl's back. Yeah. You got all these dead. Fleetwood Mac, Lenny Bruce, that's awesome. Another corner here. Is this is this stuff in the corner older here or just random? Uh in the way back? Yeah. What's the country? Oh, okay. This is a country corner. <laughs> And you have upstairs too, right? Yeah, and oh. I, I love that pink place stuff in the corner. I gotta show you that. This is my favorite. <laughs> Nelson's garbage can. <laughs> That's so funny. That's probably worth a fortune. Yeah. I really like the animals <laughs> thing in the corner over there. That, that, that mobile. Oh, that's awesome. 
in the frozen. <laughs> exactly. Bobblehead Niner. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's like they don't want that to be known. Who did the uh, jazz musicians? I don't know. I picked those up a long time ago. It's nice, though. Yeah. In Alice in Wonderland. This yeah, Pink Floyd right. thing is awesome. This is original promotion for the album. Uh, for which? For animals. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only one I've ever seen. I love that album. Yeah. Woody the Woodpecker. You know, my dad's name is Woody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's funny. And my grandfather was Woodrow. You got an Elvis clock. John Lennon, that's a cool picture. You don't see that every day, that portrait. So as you can see, there is tons of stuff here to look at in the Mill Valley Music Record Store, Music Store. That Grateful Dead sign's cool. Where did that come from? Terrapin Station? It's the same. It's a promotional thing when the album came out. Oh, okay. Todd Rundgren, Jerry Garcia. Huh, that Paul McCartney and the Wings poster is really neat. I like that. Yeah, I think that was like from 77 or something. Or That's, yes, 76. That's 76? Cow Palace. Wow. Yeah. Cow Palace is, <laughs> I've seen many of concerts there. All um, metal. Which is definitely Yeah, all metal. What's upstairs? More records? Uh, more posters and oh, more cool. records. Yeah, more records. So that's, a, that's an original Blues for Allah thing. This is Talking Heads, isn't it? Yeah, they just reissued those. Is that a live album? I've never yeah, heard. Yeah, it's a double live. Hmm. Oh, you got the original Mill Valley Music poster, too. Yeah. That's awesome. Those are a silk screen. Only 50 made of that one. There's two co two colors, 50 made each. So this poster here that I'm pointing the camera at is uh, a shop that closed, what, 13 years ago? or? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I opened a month and a half yeah. after. And I was there for 27. So I used to always buy my records there. Yeah. Got ACDC back in black there. Nice one. <laughs> I remember yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> and Hendrix, yes. Wow, you do have a lot of cool posters here. Oh, yeah. Is everything here for sale? Uh, most of it would be big money, but potentially. And then I'm not, not there to be sold, but I have sold stuff. So most of them are really rare and expensive? Yeah, a lot of it. Yeah. I like the dragon in the corner. And more in the corner. Some stereo equipment here. More posters. So this is Mill Valley Music. So if you're in the Bay Area, definitely take a drive to Mill Valley and check out this awesome music store. It has a little bit of everything. And you even got the solar powered moving flowers. <laughs> That's a cool Beatles poster, the like pencil drawing one. We haven't utilized the ceiling yet. 
<laughs> no, I, I decided not to, actually. Remember when you were a kid, yeah. you had ceiling posters? Yeah, I decided not to. I thought I, 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 I didn't have the quite right feng shui. <laughs> I thought about it. Yeah. But yeah. That's the original cool. register from there. This is actually the original counter, too. From Village Music? From Village, yeah. We, ref we, I refurbished, the, we refurbished the counter. That's cool. And uh, he like, he, this is like on an like extensive loan. <laughs> you even have these old uh, postcards. Yeah. Hmm. No 45 up there. Yeah, boxes and boxes of those upstairs. Yeah. So as you can see, there is tons of stuff here. So give them a call if you need anything. You mail out all over. You can. Yep. Yeah. All right. You can mail. Anywhere um, in the U.S.? Yeah. U.S., yeah. I don't yeah, know no international. Do Sorry, folks. But in the U.S., call yeah. if you need anything. Yeah. If he doesn't have it, he'll get it for you. All right. Cool. So, thanks for coming with me to check out Mill Valley Music. It's a super cool old-school record store. As you can see, he has so much inventory, it's coming out the walls. So if you guys need any records or want any vinyl shipped to you, or if you're in the Bay Area, make sure you stop by and visit Gary in Mill Valley on Miller Avenue. And let me see the address. Uh, anyway, <laughs> it's in the 300. You, you can't miss it. I don't see the address anymore. So that's Mill Valley Music. So definitely come check it out when you get a chance, alright? Thanks for watching. Alright.